Hello guys, in this tutorial I will try to show you how to use the 4 berry method by QLEG. Now, uh, last time he made an update on his street and it's very very simple to use this method and it's very realistic. It's the most immersive method that I uh, used in uh, Silent Hunter 5, ok? So for that I will play with the Darwright interface version 6.4 <coughs> I will have uh, installed the uh, uh, mod uh, ch5.exe patch I will use real navigation and I will play uh, a realistic 100% so I can not show you that my torpedo hit the target with, with my camera but we can hear uh, with the hydrophone, ok? So, <coughs> I will go here on the option and I will choose realistic 100% apply change and yes and I will choose uh, the four bearing and start and see you in the game so here we are in game guys so as I told you I will uh, explain you the four bearing method by QLEG the last one the improved one uh, so it is very easy to play like this in my opinion this is the most immersive and most realistic method that can be used in uh, simula uh, Silent Hunter 5 or 4 okay, but we will play Silent Hunter 5 now so we will don't use hydrophone to take range with the ping we will use the hydrophone only to listen by range we will take 4 bearings in fact we will take 3, three bearings we will apply a formula and we will find the 4 bearings the fourth bearing, we will move our U-boat and we will take the position of the front first bearing and uh, with all this data we can find everything about the ship the range, the distance, the angle and bow, the speed, everything <coughs> so it's very simple and very immersive and realistic absolutely 100% ok? So uh, <coughs> I will play the, the easiest one, uh, it, it is another method that you can uh, apply which il you are moving with your robot, but I prefer to play the one that I am stopped, so before start you must be completely stopped, like here, speed 0, you see, <coughs> nodes, and as you can observe I am 19 uh, meter depth. First I will ask my navigator to calculate my position, because I am playing real navigation, after that <laughs> I will go and I will order Siren running oh, and I will send my men to the battle station. And I will go to the hydro station. Okay. I will search for the contact. I will move my hydro wheel. Here. I just have here Merchant. You see? Now I will ask my sonar guy to report near his sound contact. I will do this all the time in my game by use, using my keyboard. I am press the KZ. Okay, so you see near his sound contact medium r speed blah blah blah. So it's 258. If I'm going here 258. See here. You can hear a little bit uh, the the noise of the uh, engine of the <coughs> boat. So, what I'll do? I'll take my clock and I, I'll start my chronometer and in the same time I'll press the ZK to ask for the uh, bearing right now. So the bearing is 258, okay? So this is our first bearing. What I'll doing? I'm going here and my heading is 30 degree. I take the ruler I go here 30 degree and I put here okay and I go 30 degree here on my projector here so this is my heading now he told me the bearing is 258 degree okay so what is mean this it's mean 360 degree minus 258 it's exactly 102 degree on my left side so I will take the protector and I will go from here to here 
Okay. And I'll go until I will have one zero two. Okay, see here is one zero two. One zero two. Is like here. You see? Almost. This is <coughs> one zero two. I take the ruler and I go for example from this I will draw a line from here and I will go with this line until my U-boat okay this here this is the f the first bearing and I will do another thing and I will explain you a little bit later why I'm doing this so on the third bearing also you take the compass and you put your compass here And I go with my compass until the U-boat. And we will do like this for the first bearing and the third bearing. Okay? Only for the first and the third. And you will see why. Okay? So like here. Perfect. Okay. <coughs> so now I must to choose uh, the time interval that I use before taking the bearings. The time interval must to be the same. Okay? So which in uh, usually is better to use a big value for the time interval. Why? Because you will have a more accurate result. If the time interval is bigger the ac the result is more accurate. But uh, the time interval is related also on many factors. So like now for example he told me the contact is medium speed it's closing so it's heading in my direction and the it's long range so that means uh, I have time to use uh, a time interval big because he's away long away from my position and he's closing I try to imagine for example if he's saying here the contact is moving away so if you use a time interval between the three bearings the contract maybe you lost the contact because maybe he will pass the 20 kilometers range of the, your hydrophone <coughs> so you see you must to adapt you before each uh, re related to the each situation you are in game okay so uh, <coughs> uh, another factor uh, for example you can take you see right now let's go at the okay so right now I have passed five minutes okay so I'll take the bearing so I see here I have 259, here I have 258, so it's not good. Between the first and the second bearing it's better to have like minimum 5-6 degree, okay? So if you have less than 5-6 degree, just wait another 5 minutes, another 5 minutes, it's like this, okay? So in this case, because it's e easiest for me to calculate like each 30 minutes, okay? So I'll take my first bearing at 30 minutes, okay? After 30 minutes, so I, I will use the time interval 30 minutes in my case okay I can I can choose by uh, very easy my time interval because I play a lot with this method and I know the situation what is better for me but you can do like this take the first bearing after minutes take the second one if the difference decreased to, to uh, it's not five six degree maybe uh, minimum wait another five minutes wait another five minutes until you will have six seven eight nine ten degrees okay <coughs> so uh, in this situation I will uh, use the tie compression until I will have here 30 minutes, okay? So let, let's use the time compression. can play this method even uh, you don't want to use the real navigation or the realism 100% you can play with this method even if you play with the map contact on because it, this method is uh, better to find the course of the ship which is far away maybe 18 10 20 kilometers for you also it's better to use this uh, just a second it's better to use this when you have heavy fog days and you cannot see the ship until you will be near maybe two, three hundred meters. <laughs> so you cannot hunt visual, okay? And you will not see uh, the contact on the map also if you have fog. 
So I'll take my uh, my first, uh, my second bearing on this line here will be at 30. So I will use uh, again a little bit of time compression. This is the last minute. So when I will have this line here, I will just press ZK to do. <coughs> Et voilà, on est arrivé jusqu'à là bas. Ici, go. So right now, I have the bearing is 26, 263 degrees, so 263. What I will do? 360 minus 263 equal 97 degree on my left side. So I, I will just take the protector and I will go here. You, you will follow the degrees, okay? So I will go until I will have 97 degrees. So 198. Okay, 97, 97, 97, 97, 97, 98, no, 97, here is 97, perfect, so I have my second bearing, I will took the ruler, and I will draw the second bearing with my ruler line from here until here okie dokie so it, it's perfect now <coughs> the third bearing as I, I, I explained it before we must wait the same time interval between we, we uh, used here okay so here uh, I used uh, 30 minutes here I will wait again 30 minutes <coughs> so you see here I must this line must to pass all the uh, dials until here again okay so time compression as usual okay time compression time compression so as you can see I for so here I had 258 here I had 263 so the difference is bit it's almost five I told you, if you have five lists, at least five, six, it's okay. So th the difference from the first to second, in my case, was like five. Okay, so it's okay. It's better to wait. for me. It was better, for example, to wait longer, but uh, I don't want to miss with this dial when I explain. Okay, so time compression. <coughs> So as you can see, we don't use the ping, the hydro ping. I understood that uh, in that those times, he, if you use the hydro ping to to find range, they can spot you, and uh, was like dangerous maybe. As you see, only we listen by hydro, and we will find all the data that we need. And if you don't have so the so. You don't need any patch for this. Uh, you need the patches uh, f the hydro broken uh, to to have a better uh, hydro phone to work. Only this you need to have installed live mods. It's very important this one. CH5.XA patch 01. It's 